previously in Cyberpunk 2077. Now, to figure out what I'm doing. Uh, hey, I certainly wasn't going to let you do something this stupid on your own. Nervous? You seem a bundle of nerves. I'm a man to kill the bastard who want their hands. And don't get me wrong. There's an option three. Don't don't rule out option three. Especially not with her at your side. See you later. Thanks. could you maybe refrain from walking right through me? Dear God, that was disturbing on so many levels. And now to continue. Right. I think I'm finally over the shock of feeling disembodied. So, what should I do next? I was clearing out missions in Watson, but now I'm in Japantown, and well, since I'm here, I feel like I might as well do something in the area. Um, oh well, Takamura's nearby. I suppose I could go meet with him. I've put it off for quite a while. Where's my car? car as if I would ever actually ride a car okay we got some fans of the president right and a traffic jam well that's why I'm on a motorcycle I don't need to worry about no stinking traffic jam we're just gonna leave I do feel like my driving is improving a little bit. I'll emphasize the little bit considering I just drove through a guardrail. Where the heck am I supposed to be going? Whoa! Why did those arrows have me? I love this cybernetic implant giving me this GPS tracking when I'm on my bike, but why is it... Okay, fine. I guess I gotta get off of my bike. I just got on this silly thing, though, and it was nice. Okay, where am I supposed to be going exactly? Sorry, sorry, officer. I'm really clumsy. Oh, anything new in the news? Oh god, that's not news. Gross. The things you guys think is good food. Ugh. I miss my home cooking. Alright. Where? Okay. This is a very odd spot to be meeting. Does this have something to do with that parade? I remember Wakako mentioning a parade. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Suits know one spark's all it takes for Japan Town to go up in flames. And riots are always best put down by folks not sporting your brand name. Right, I don't feel like I should interrupt. He's talking with police. Ah, uh, you are here. Yeah, sorry it took so long. I, uh, got a little... hung up doing other things. Oh, hi. It's, it's good to see you. Goro, good to see you. As it is to see you, V. Ma'am. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? 
He's a murderer. The irony makes me sick. Really? Because it seems... Well, it seems like the type of thing a Nepo baby would do. Yeah, I thought Yori wasn't one for tradition, though. Would you let me process my thoughts first? Yeah, I thought Yori wasn't so much one for tradition. What's in it for Yorinobu? Doesn't seem like the kind who'd care to honor tradition. That is so. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and I will see in them a hidden message to his foes. What message that be? I am here, Gumindomo. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass um. precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Are you crazy? In front of everyone? <laughs> you are not shit crazy. In front of a crowd? What about security? Or you need not to worry. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place. Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Okay. You actually make it sound doable. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Yeah, where'd you get it? Where'd you get this shard? Across the canal. Kabuki. Might actually be half decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. All right, all right. Let's look at your plan. Where exactly do you plan to jump from? Let us move on. Move on. Where are we going? To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. Yeah! We have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal okay. with them as I advance. I had a feeling that's where I was going to come in. Sounds like a good plan. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, I, I can handle a few snipers. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. I'm a bit more well, curious about what the hell is behind you. Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. Okay. You, you want me to go... Ah, over there, There's huh? No time to waste, B. I'm going, I'm going. Hold your horses. Oh. How... Exactly. Okay, here we go. Could have at least explained exactly how it is I was supposed to get in here. Oh, look! Contraceptives. Just what I needed. Why did I pick that up? I know why. Because it's something I can sell. Boing! My jumpy legs are nice, but sometimes they get me in trouble. Okay, I'm in. Kind of. Provided this door doesn't close behind me. I'll close it myself, though, because I don't want to be seen doing dirty work. 
Just wants me to hack some cameras. This should be a breeze. Uh, let's let's save that and read it when we're somewhere a little more private. That one too. Yes, absolutely. Um, don't don't need to be. Hmm. The things you find on the street just laying around. Ah, okay. Not exactly fucking worked. obvious, but hey, we're good to go. And that is not an actual door. What? What? Hey, what? Why is this open? I closed that. I don't like this. Goro, was I seen? Did someone come in behind me? I closed that door. And? Ah. Uh, system's all ours. Done. System's ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... What? Could you finish the sentence, please? See, I have not eaten since yesterday. Oh, thank God, food. I'm famished. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. Dude, he, he cooks it here. Everything is local. Can I get some takoyaki? Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. Mm, that looks really good. Oh yeah. Oh that hits the spot. It's not takoyaki, but it, it's it's really good. Nope. I want more. Talk later. Eat now. So good. Oh. Ah. Can I get some more? Please? That was that was really good. I'm sorry, you said something, Johnny? I was busy enjoying my meal. What do you have against Takamura? He's not a bad guy. Chill, Johnny. He's Saka scum to you. I know that, but Goro's not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. He was Saburo fucking Arasaka's bodyguard. Think his and? eyes landed him that gig? What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Come on, Goro, it's not that bad. Okay, I have laid the plan. Dude. One. You gonna finish we that? Break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half. We have Hanako Sama's float. Two. During the parade. Yo, if you don't want it, hand it over. I'm still hungry. You eliminate any snipers. Three. I get onto the float. Four. I convince Hanako Sama of the truth. Um. Well, I've done dumber stuff. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so. Things even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. All right. Uh, Don't let him off his can, can I help? Stranger in a strange land. Going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. I can be of use. This we will do together. Seriously, dude, if you're not going to finish that. Louder! Louder! In the flesh. 
President Myers has he eliminated the last obstacle between himself and the complete power. And they surrendered it to him. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a Arasaka? Ah, I have built to last before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. So, hey, watch your language. So, where did he get his rebellious streak? Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon. <laughs> I shall ask him in person. And what factions are we dealing with? Got factions inside Arasaka? What are they? There are three Kiji, Hato, and Taka. Kiji longs for stability. The old order. They are united behind Hanako sama. The liberal okay. wing, Hato, Sapoto Michiko sama, Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about him some other time. No, no, no. Why did I say that? No, I want to know about them now. Especially Taka and how to kill them. Alright, so why did Saburo yeah, allow this to happen? Me. Would you let me monologue? Well, why did Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu. For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. Now I see. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. She loved her brother. You think she might have a change of heart now? Feels like that's about to change. As long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events. Conscience could also come into play. Assuming she's got one. We must reach her first. Will you join me? Yeah, let's go. Sure, why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. I did. So dust and plastic. Come on, it wasn't that bad. Seriously, let me have it. We can take it with. Come. I have found a good place. To have observe. you now? Uh, where are we exactly? Oh, this is... This is not the same place we just left. Oh. Okay. You brought me to Timbuktu. Now I've got a new area to go do various random jobs. Once we're done meeting here. Oh, hey. Uh, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll be right with you, just... I am not gonna leave that behind. Right, sorry, sorry. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. Yeah, definitely don't need people asking questions about why two random strangers are walking onto a construction site. With no foreseeable reason. As to why. Um, ritual bowl? That's weird. Oh well. Where are we going? To 
the roof, I'm assuming. It's the only place this elevator takes us. Why are we here? Th and what does this have to do with the parade? You said we're doing some reconnaissance. But of what exactly? I would call this a beautiful view of the city. If. If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much? I mean... Perhaps I'm <clears throat> simply homesick, as you say. Now... Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Homesickness. Weaknesses. While I try to Aww. think of a diversion, no. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attentions. Yeah, I don't you exactly know how we're gonna do life. this. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Uh, okay. Can we get some food? Oh, can you run and grab us a pizza? Take out the food? No. Just no. What? If I had time and ingredients, I would prepare some onigiri with cod or with grilled salmon. No thanks, dude. I don't like fish. Seriously, pizza. Pizza sounds great. No, even better. With umeboshi plums. Mmm, Arasaka-sama's favorite appetizer. Simple, tasty, and filling. I found him chewing once. Pride on his face. It was a protein bar. Saburo Arasaka with a protein bar. Get out of here. Like a true soldier. Well, I okay. mean, if he was yeah. military, that's well, actually we not far-fetched. And I, I've never actually had plums before. But, no, seriously, pizza sounds great right now. Alright, what are we looking at? So we gotta break in here to, what, survey the, the floats? You never fully explained exactly what it is we're doing. We got a nice, fancy comm system here. Got eyes on the comm system. A lot of guards. What else is in the area that I can poke and prod at? I could use comms for a diversion. Yeah, and I mean that would help me get in the front door, maybe. Provided we're not going to go in guns blazing. What about the pipes? The pipes. See them? We could use them to get inside. Okay. Got an intent security Intel. hub. Security hub's liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. Yeah, we can disable the security systems. Camouflage Front gate's guarded. By the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. This is not bad. Okay. So, we must be aware of the mech. Yeah, I see him too. I mean, I could just take him out now. There's a service tunnel. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. We've also got a bridge I can walk over. Footbridge, but it's guarded. We will use it to enter if there's no other way. And then I could always just jump the banister. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. Okay. I really think maybe the service tunnel will be my best option. Question is how to get into that service I think tunnel. I've seen everything. We have what we came for. And how so, to do it without alerting guards. Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kombik Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in then. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. And get some food. Can we revisit this idea of ordering pizza, please? Damn. How long have we what? been here, man? 
I'm a... Oh, good. No we did order something. Do you see it? That cat? He's cute. Thought they'd all disappeared. Yeah, thought they'd all disappeared. Fine looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. I think I've actually seen Perhaps that cat once a before. Bacaneco. Bacaneco? A bacaneco? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune. Can restore the dead back to life. Misfortune. Uh. I mean, no evidence to say it's not. Feline ghost. I suppose anything's possible. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko, too. Kappa? You miss home, don't you? Miss home? A foolish question. I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Uh -huh. Bad memories washed away by time. You killed someone, didn't you? only for the simple days of childhood. You're not the only one. Childhood memories. Well, let's see. Hopping buildings, running away from badges, iron taste of blood from a split lip. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. So you grew up on the streets just like me, huh? Why military transports running through a slum? Transporters, you say? Armored and armed, Chiba 11 had the most murders in all Japan. Oh, geez. It probably still has. Something tells me that even though it has the highest murder rate in Japan, it's still less than Night City. So what they need kids for? What they need kids for? To be corporate soldiers. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before, discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. I see. So you got a leg up. So how'd you end up working for Saburo? So how's a corporal rookie go from cleaning latrines to being Saburo Arasaka's bodyguard? The highest grades at the academy, service in the special forces, and Arasaka-sama's unmatched eye for talent. So you're That's actually quite a badass. You at first sight. To make the right decisions with imperfect knowledge, that is how you become the world's most powerful man. 100 candidates standing at attention, and Arasaka-sama looked into each of our souls and chose the one who would serve him best. Hmm. I see. Did what you had to to keep from going hungry. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend, Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. No judgment, man. Survival is a necessity. You do what you gotta do to stay alive. I respect that. I'm not judging you. Wasn't judging you. And true, you oppose the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world in its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists, as if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability? 
Safety. Chiba eleven slum rats? They're there. Scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that too. We cannot fix everything at once. The problem isn't that you can't fix everything at once. The problem is, is that they don't try fixing anything at all. You already forget what happened at Tom's Diner? People hate corpse more than anything. Can't blame them either. Got some regrets, but Quepin from Arasaka ain't one of them. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad, to leave this world. Forget everything. It's never too late. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. That's only part of the expression. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Compeki, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this, so we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Finally starting to make some sense. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or she'll make sure we die for good. Bakaneko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. Sweep. I think it is time to do something. Hmm? Oh. I'll be with you in just a minute. Oh, Getting worse. You do not look so bad. You say that, you don't see what's in my head. Uh, dude, I'm standing right in front of you. Meet at Santa Ana Street. I'm waiting by the construction site. It is visible from a distance. See you soon. Uh, what? Oh, message from Judy. Hey, buried Ev today. Columbarium near North Oak. Thought you might want to know. Okay. Didn't remember that I had a message from Judy. And why did you send me a text telling me about the thing that we just did? It's a little weird, Goro. Just a little weird. So where are we going now? And what was the point of us sitting there all that time? Just to turn around and leave, like... Tell me this is all part of the plan, because I am thoroughly confused right now as to why we just wasted all that time just sitting up there. Are we actually going to go break in now? Because I thought that part comes later. Ooh! Purple thing, purple thing, cannot leave the purple thing. Okay. Suddenly there's barbed wire on the gate. Oh, right, we didn't actually come in that way. I'll be in touch. The diversion reaction, that is mine to do. Okay, so we are doing this right now. I don't think this is a good idea. Neither is you driving, apparently. You're as bad at it as I am. My god. Okay, no, he's leaving. There's a purple thing here. Ooh. I don't know what I just picked up, but it was purple. Oh, and there's an orange over there. I love shiny colors. What do we got? Tier 5 component. Yay! And 
a Netrunner outfit that I'll probably never wear. Right. Okay. Dear God. So... He wants me to break into Arasaka HQ. Right now. And he just drove away. Does anybody else feel like I've just been set up as the ultimate patsy?